What's up, YouTube? Uh, Sniper1. Um, today I'm going to be doing a Black Ops 2 review. Um, today I'm just be doing some facts, some facts I have about it, and um, some of my own thoughts about the game itself, and what I've seen of the gameplays and information. But um, the things I've heard about it is, um, see, like, Black Ops 1 was originally supposed to take place there in like I feel you back and they had Vietnam Vietnam and stuff like that, like Cold War and stuff like that. It was going like kinda of taking an order from after World War Two to like during the nineteen seventies, you know, like eighties, early eighties. But um the new Black Ops two is supposed to take place in 2025 so it's gonna be a futuristic game of course obviously but the um the guns and stuff is what up from what i've seen is pretty sweet one gun i saw is a sniper rifle i believe and when it zooms in the scope actually sees through the wall so basically to me, that seems pretty cool, because you can shoot through any type of wall from what I've seen, but if you don't like campers, that's a perfect gun. Anyways, um, you get what I've obviously heard, which I, I know some people don't like it, obviously. You're going to expect that, but you're going to be fighting robots. There's supposed to be something about robots supposedly supposed to be like turning on us after they they don't draw no more soldiers out from United States Army and all the branches different branches but so they're supposed to just using robots but supposedly somebody from a different country like Russia or China um, hacked into it to where we'll be fighting robots which is true it's supposedly retarded but you know as long as like it, is it's supposed to be to me just like I like it better when you just fight regular people, but to me, if I was on like the robot side, if in versus multiplayer, yeah, uh, that'd be pretty sweet. But you know, people have their different, you know, opinions about it. So to me, I think it's gonna be probably a about a pretty kind of like good game, but. Obviously, from what I heard about robots and stuff, you know, that just kind of upset me. The guns, the guns looks pretty sweet, but technology from having motorcycles and stuff like we've seen in Black Ops 1 and Modern Warfare 3 and stuff ain't going to be like that. It's going to have some of that, I think, but um, you're going to be riding horseback, so you're going to have some horses, man. <laughs> but that just seems kind of fun. I mean, that's going to be cool. Because you get to ride on horses, you know, when, but modern day guns and stuff. So it's going to be like a pretty sweet game. Um, I recommend you buy it. Because for the Call of Duty fans, you should have everyone to me. That's what I have, you know, I have everyone. You always want to put yourself to the test on it. And they're, in the menus, I was talking about a scene, they're going to have affected modes. You know, they're going to have all that cool stuff. They're going to have some new modes. And, you know, multiplayer is going to be the same, but it's going to have different, you know, guns, obviously, because it's futuristic. Um, Newtown, that's going to be sweet, you know, futuristic, so. Um, anyways, if, if the Black Ops series ends at this, it's going to be pretty upsetting, but, anyways, me, I wasn't really big on Black Ops because... Of how it was drawn out. The campaign was pretty sweet, but multiplayer to me was just kind of upsetting because, I mean, I was pretty good for a while. The rank was pretty sweet at it, but I just got spawn killed, like, obviously, the, and modders or hackers or whatever. They're, just, they're glitching out of maps and stuff, and ain't really that fun. Like, what at War, obviously, has been taken over by moderator, by modders, not moderators, sorry. And, um, 
for you don't for people who don't know what a modder is, it's basically people who do stuff to the game that you can't do normally. So you can get out maps and stuff, float around, get a limited ammo and stuff like that. But anyways, me, I personally think they should come out. They should grow the series of Modern Warfare because it's such a big Call of Duty, such a big fran franchise. I mean, they have great Modern Warfare Three. But it sucks me about it is the spawning. The spawning is really bad though. But that's gonna be my next video. It is Modern Warfare Three. Um. Anyways, I hope y'all like this video. Um, if y'all have any questions or y'all can feel free to comment down below. Um, if y'all have any facts that I don't know about it, uh, please feel free to comment below. Um. Please like, um, rate my video for me, um, please subscribe, uh, I'll be bringing you some more gameplays as, if you are a subscriber to me, or if you ain't, um, I recommend you would subscribe to me, cause my capture card is supposed to be in, sorry about that, um, in about a few weeks, um, cause mine broke, so... But anyways, I have great gameplays, Moabs, and everything for y'all in store. Um, my channel will grow. It will be a um, great channel for y'all. But if y'all subscribe to me, um, like I said, if, if y'all ain't in my comments, I will subscribe back. But I um, appreciate all the viewers. I um, appreciate the subscribers. Um, but... I hope y'all like this video, and I hope y'all like my other videos. Please check out my Modern Warfare 3 videos. Um, and my Gears of War video, I'm sorry about that, guys. That was a pretty upsetting video, because my capture card was obviously unedited very well, because it was messing up, and it broke. But, um, hope y'all like this video. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and like. Thank you.